Maine's second largest city has a new mayor. Good evening, I'm Pat Callahan. Lewiston inaugurated its new city officials this evening. The ceremony held in a packed Gendron Franco Center. School committee members, city councilors, and a new mayor all took the oath of office. That includes Lewiston's youngest and first ever Somali American city councilor, Sophia Khalid. She faced harsh criticism on social media during the campaign and shortly after the election, but she says she is ready for her new role. As a Somali American, as a Muslim, as a black woman, of all the identities that I carry, it means that anything's possible, that you can do anything that you want. And um, for me, it's not about how historic this election is, but it's about the challenges um, and the issues that the residents of Lewiston are facing. Governor Mills was among those on hand for tonight's inauguration. It came after a year of turmoil in the mayor's office. Former Mayor Shane Bouchard resigned in March amid a scandal surrounding racist text messages and rumored violations of election laws that were later proved not credible. He was replaced by former City Council President Kristen Cloutier. And tonight, another former city official was sworn in for a full term. Mark Kayer, who served on the City Council and the school board, took the oath of office as the new mayor. He says he's looking forward to serving Lewiston and seeing the positive direction that the city continues to move toward. I'm really excited about some of the change that's been happening here. We truly have some developers that have been looking at Lewiston. Uh, some of our mills have been uh, bought in and they're truly looking at uh, bringing uh, diverse businesses to this area. The new leaders will hit the ground running. They'll be at City Hall tomorrow for the first City Council meeting of 2020.